All right, this video is typical day on the FOB. What is a FOB, you might ask? Well, FOB stands for Forward Operating Base, and it's just what it sounds like. It's a small base. Um, we've got FOBs all over the various war zones that we have, and today I'm gonna take you around and show you as much as I can. There's a lot of stuff I can't put in this video, um, or I'll get fired, maybe worse, but uh, I'm gonna show you what I can, and just let you know, I'm not gonna try to take this video all in one day because uh, I work 12 hours a day, seven days a week. So um, I just don't have the time, free time to uh, make a video like this in one day. But I will try to give you as true, uh, true to life representation as I can of what it is like to be on a FOB. Occasionally we get mortar or rocket attacks. So we've got bunkers to hide in all over the place. They look like this. Pretty much every day, Everything gets covered in dust. Rain. So, Afghanistan is mostly mostly high desert, very mountainous. Um, normally it's pretty dry, but you do get these stretches of rain like today. Uh, you also, in the high desert, you can you might wake up one morning and need a winter jacket and by afternoon be sweating in a t-shirt. Um, both throughout the year, different times of the year, but even throughout the day, you can have a huge variety. Um, big changes in temperature. One way or the other, it's usually pretty extreme. So normally I eat in the DFAC. Uh, DFAC is military speak for cafeteria. I think it stands for dining facility or something. But I can't, uh, I can't take any video in there, so I figured I'd uh, grab a to-go plate and show you what I eat anyway, it's a little, probably a little different and healthier than what most folks in there eat. Um, a little cup of nuts, some yogurt, and then, cause I'm trying to, trying to eat sort of heart healthy, um, diet healthy. I, I just grabbed a, a couple slices of cheese and some meat, um, and mostly vegetables. Uh, you got a lot of choices in there. Um, it's actually pretty good food for being out in a, forward operating base of FOB, but um, so that's what lunch looks like. Um, breakfast, they've actually got pretty good omelets and uh, scrambled eggs. Uh, dinner's hit or miss. Uh, sometimes it's quite terrible. Biggest problem with the defect is uh, it's getting sick. Um, I don't know. Sometimes hygiene is not what it should be with the people working in there. So uh, little stomach problems are the norm. helicopter so these are our bathrooms um, you don't have a lot of privacy and they're often pretty gross we have signs for just about everything signs telling you that you can't drink the water signs telling you not to blow your nose in the sink signs telling you to clean up after yourself. Um, they feel they need to put up a sign for every possible thing. Constant, constant noise. Noise from trucks, generators, air conditioners, noise from the, the Afghans outside the base. Noise from drones, noise from planes, constant noise. Of course, there are places to work out, get a little exercise. This is the mystery restaurant that apparently has never been open. We've got this crazy Afghan barber shop. I went here once and the haircut they gave me was great, but I haven't gone back because the unexpected, unwanted chiropractic adjustment they gave me was not so cool. Some days the work is really easy, and other days the work is the worst thing on earth. Some days you have to rewire pumps that are located in a vat full of shit. So, you know how I said I was going to make a typical day video? Well, these are not typical times. Um, Recently, um, since I started this video, there was the uh, 
assassination of Soleimani, the Iranian general. And um, things have been kind of high alert here ever since. And uh, just now we got an announcement to uh, put on our body armor. And uh, so I zipped over to my room to get it. And on the way into my room to get my body armor, they made an announcement to shelter in place. Um, so now I'm just hunkered down in my room. It's not that this stuff doesn't happen, but this is not the norm. Um, I guess not a typical day.